The analog vacuum default settings allows you to set the threshold used by the vacuum monitoring function to determine part lost. To set this value, you must be in the text editor with the existing program and end of arm tool mounted on the robot. Select the setup tab and from the drop down, select setup default vacuum level. Choose the vacuum circuit that you are going to test and tap and turn to the on position. Put parts on the vacuum circuit so all of the vacuum cups are holding parts. With the parts loaded on the vacuum circuit, we see that the vacuum required to hold all parts on vacuum one is 80%. Now try to remove one part from the vacuum circuit and monitor where the smaller bar will drop to. Knowing where that value is, set the smaller bar to create a window of sensitivity or a threshold that you will allow vacuum to reduce to before signifying that a part has lost. So in this instance, we see that the parts need to be held with 73% vacuum. We're allowing vacuum to drop to 50% before triggering the alarm. Once these values are set, select the OK, OK tab. Then you can transfer the program to the CPU, and these values will be enacted whenever vacuum level drops below that threshold. A vacuum part monitoring loss alarm will occur, dropping the robot into a manual mode. When the program is saved, these values are saved with it, and whenever you open that program again, those values will be enacted.